Dr. Danielle Fraser and I'm a research scientist here at the Canadian Museum of Nature and I study mammal paleobiology. In the collections we have two tusks um, and we were unsure whether they belong to mammoth or mastodon. So today we took sections out of both of those tusks and we examined the pattern of the dentin layers in those sections uh, to determine whether they were mammoth and mastodon. And this works because mammoths have a characteristic W pattern, whereas a mastodon would have an X or a checkerboard pattern. And so in this case, we identified both tusks in the collections to belong to mammoth. Tusks have a surprisingly enormous amount of scientific value because we can use things like chemical analysis to go in and sample and understand what the animal was eating and drinking throughout its lifetime.